Okay, here we go. Uh, you two ready? Do you both have it open? Ready to go? Yeah, I may or may not watch what you actually play. Guns of Blazing. Uh, have uh, you ever played a Katamari? Katamari? Oh, yeah. I thought you said Calamari, I was like, oh. Hey, excuse <laughs> Calamari. Sweet. Oh, delicious. Oh. Alright, what the hell is this? Uh, it's oh. Japanese. Really fucking Japanese. It's... You roll, and you win. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> And this this is guy. how I roll. Uh, anyone in the stream, like, how's the audio levels? Is anything too loud? Yeah, please too tell loud me if I should game? shout. Yeah. Like. <laughs> <laughs> That's how we adjust put on audio levels around yeah, here. Yeah, I'll just <laughs> I'll put on earmuffs and then I'll just yell into the microphone. <laughs> Good idea. We may do that anyway. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like fun, though. I'll just do it. <laughs> oh shit, that's get, getting me caught in the uh, stream, isn't it? Freaking yogurt commercial. <laughs> I gotta fix All this. All these real quick. flowery flavors. There we go. And now it's time to go. Uh, hmm, press start. Oh, Katamari, how long it has been. Who's this asshole? I think that's his head, actually. I think that's your dad. <laughs> no, he, did. he does have <laughs> one of them butt chins. Actually, this is what his asshole looks like. <laughs> oh, I guess the, it's, the black it's just another thing. face. <laughs> and just the rest of what we see here is... It's just the butt. Oh, but one it's hard question to see that I have is why is it spinning? Uh, it, it's more convenient that way for him, I don't know. Muscle movements? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, it makes him into the bathroom faster. He has to faster. keep the thing flying somehow. Yeah. Uh... Alright, tutorial fly. Alright, stream chat not loading, that is my favorite thing to happen right now. Noise. Okay. There is, there's nothing gonna go on in there anyway. Yeah, why bother? I'll be too busy uploading like a million videos right now anyway. <laughs> well shit. Just upload. What the hell's going on? Well obviously we're in space, so we can can remove the setting as one of our questions. He just like flew right into the goddamn moon. He destroyed a whole bunch of stars on his way to the moon. <laughs> well, what is he doing? This is terrible. He destroyed terrible every universe game. except for one. Oh no, there it goes. And check out that <laughs> bulge. Why is it so pronounced? Is there an answer to that? Or just leave it as is. <laughs> uh. No, you see, he's just, he's perpetually sleeping. He has one of those, uh, really sweet pillows. Inside of his pants? Inside. <laughs> right on his crotch? Oh. Right on his crotch. He has a pillow on his crotch. <laughs> for maximum comfort. Whatever works for him. I'll go, just go. So does the, um, gameplay ever change in Katamari? Eventually, um, you start picking up living things. <laughs> sometimes the goal's different. Like, uh, instead of just trying to get a big Katamari, you uh, try to make it catch on fire. But usually, like, it's pretty much the same no matter what. Yeah. So you're always just rolling out? Yeah. Yeah, I remember my friend eventually got to some impossibly hard level. Oh my so God. I was just like, time to get Mari some, uh, some of the older levels. I mean, really, you get the same experience no matter what, so if you get stuck, yeah. you can just be like, well, at least I have access to this part of the game. And then you can just keep going back and being like, yeah. I'm, I'm the this. best. 
own the shit out of that level. I bet you can't even vacuum your carpet as well as I roll my ball. Speaking oh. of vacuuming, man, this person sure has a dirty ass house. Yeah. <laughs> Food, mice, uh, condoms. Wait, what? Was that an extension cord attached to an extension cord? <laughs> Whatever works. I need to have at least eight power sources coming out of that one plug. <laughs> Just keep splitting it and splitting it. I can power <laughs> the whole neighborhood. What I don't like at the beginning is like whenever you get to the size, it just like takes you away. Oh, okay. No, don't, don't keep going back and doing it. What are you doing? Stop it! <laughs> this is not how you acquire energy. <laughs> Whoop. Oh, you, you oddly shaped objects that would come back to, uh, fuck you. Uh, it, it's not really like that big of a problem, Darge. Hey, you, okay. most of the time they help you get on the ledges because yeah. they act as, like, claws for your yeah, cat Mario ball. What? No. So, from what I understand, there are, like, Ten or so games in the series. Uh, I mean, a lot of them. Maybe like six, I think. It's this Damn, this sure. one. Uh, we love Katamari. Beautiful Katamari. Uh, the PSP game, and then Katamari Forever, I think. So five. That's so. A is lot there of... a? Did Katamari there Forever the same between them, way? or or is it just? Uh, you know, like expansion packs. They probably added, like, one of them has to have, like, online multiplayer or something. Yeah, it's pretty bad, though. Uh, Beautiful Katamari had it, and it wasn't really that fun. Mm -hmm. Fuck! <laughs> 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 yeah. Something, uh, Japanese would do. Okay. Fuck the planet. We're gonna fuck the planet now. Uh. <laughs> Is that how the stars are formed? <laughs> what do you think happens think so. to that moon? Okay, he's not even speaking a language I understand. Well, I'm What's sorry. What's wall? <laughs> Put me in a goddamn basket. Sorry you're so racist, face guy. <laughs> yeah, if it's not a language I can't understand, I don't want it. I figured face guy of all people would be a fan of the king's head. <laughs> Which one? You mean he has more than- oh god. <laughs> <laughs> My mind is blown! Wait a second. This kid is really, really creative with his Legos. What with all those arches for the snails that are running around the house? <laughs> they go like right into it too, it's kind of impressive really. On his off time, he like streams snail races in his room. <laughs> I, think, I uh, do that. I think it's on <laughs> Ustream right now. Go catch it. Snail races. And Willis rounds the bend. Oh, that's <laughs> being caught up. Sounds better than this stream. Fuck this. Ouch. <laughs> well, there's snail racing in this too. I'm just kind Come of. On, vir a... Virtual oh, snail okay. races are inferior to <laughs> actual snail races. <laughs> that's bullshit. You know it. You're, we got the, you're uh, right. Too too many of them could end up being slugs in real life. Yeah. And they're cheating. Fake fake shells. <laughs> they don't have very many uh, like referees to uh, judge the race to make sure all snails are uh, following the rules correctly. <laughs> the referee is the kid's dad. <laughs> he got dragged into this somehow. Just and he's like, like well, this is my life. This is what I get for getting laid off. <laughs> but I am getting paid for this, so I can't complain. Just my my son is paying me with blip money. <laughs> Bitcoins. Bitcoin. <laughs> <laughs> my son is a Bitcoin millionaire. So 
looks like a uh, pretty good book title. <laughs> or an uh, indie movie of some kind. <laughs> Bitcoin it's like Millionaire. <laughs> <laughs> it's like some dog Millionaire, but without the quiz show part. <laughs> it's not. It's not really a feel-good movie. <laughs> Because it's actually about that guy who, who got a uh, heat stroke from having servers in his living room. Oh my god, is that a real thing? Like, I, I, th yeah. I thought it was his bedroom. <laughs> no, I don't think it was. Wow. I, I may be remembering wrong, but I know that like it, he ended up getting brain damage because of it. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I thought that was his bedroom. <laughs> oh, that was not even possible. Was, uh, not the best idea. No. But how many bitcoins did he make? A Not lot. a lot. If he ended up dying. <laughs> Whoop. No, well. he survived. He made a post about not actually going to be mining anymore, so... His will. Well, that's just more coins for us. To my wife, I give you all five million of my bitcoins. Use them well. <laughs> they, they can be used to buy vouchers for... I don't know. Anything you want, really. You'd buy no. a whole lot of weed. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, Someone say weed. Probably. <laughs> Leave it to the Indian to come in when we're talking about weed. Shit. <laughs> Someone say weed. <laughs> <laughs> and I guess the southern man. Yeah, that's it. Anyone want to do some weed eating? I mean. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this game's kind of related to weed, it's probably pretty awesome. Oh, shit. Probably all of the foundations were made with weed. One of our royal presents, a big bag of weed! Oh, thanks, <laughs> King of the Cosmos. So what are you playing? Weed bowling? Weed bowling? Eh. <laughs> weed bowling. Uh, Katamari Damacy. Which is the same thing, actually. <laughs> It teaches you how to roll a joint. <laughs> the most complicated joint. Never stop. Ever. Basically. <laughs> how high rule. can you get when you smoke the world? <laughs> I'm sorry, Prince. This joint is much too small. <laughs> it will just not do. That's, that's gonna be a mod for the next game. Surprised no one's done that It's actually that the ending of this game. I just didn't want to spoil it. Face guy versus the world of weed. <laughs> the world of weed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the world of weed. How would I the shit out of that? Oh shit. You have reached level 50 weed rolling. <laughs> what craft do you want to specialize in? Rolling oh. or token? Fucking. <laughs> That's I the only two know. crafts we got. <laughs> I don't have to, I don't have the time for the skills, man. I just go in the auction house and buy the finished product. <laughs> Is that legal? <laughs> My doctor <laughs> says yes. I go to the hospital <laughs> auction house for the medical weed. Oh shit! <laughs> I think one there is one more skill possibly that would be chilling. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's just a it passive. It combined with the other two. Yeah. yeah. Subspecialty. Final Fantasy XI style. And then there were a few of the useless skills, like, they just threw in grilling for some reason. Nobody ever thinks <laughs> that. A foot massage. <laughs> foot massage. Conspiracy griller. theory. <laughs> you can combine both of them and it's just a terrible thing. And then there's, like, aerospace engineer. <laughs> <laughs> but only, <laughs> but only you think you are. Everyone else is like, "What the fuck?" LFG. Oh shit! Sure. Aerospace engineer. <laughs> oh man, another one. We don't need those. We need some of those foot massages, man. Come on. The end. Braddy star. So can you guess what I'm doing while I'm just masturbating, talking in this call, watching Nicholas Cage interviews? <laughs> yes. 
No. Not Become anymore. Nicolas oh, here's Cage. a new Nicolas Cage movie. There is? Isn't there oh. one like every month or so? I'm <laughs> making another Cross. Ghost Rider movie. I accidentally skipped it. He is. Yeah. Oh god. I'm Ghost Rider or Nicolas Cage making cancer. <laughs> I didn't That's know that the then. Kermit the Frog resorted to making dance music. Um, dance videos. Yeah. The tagline for it is, uh, uh, what was it? Uh, what if you need to take a piss while you're on fire? It's awesome. What? <laughs> How's that a tagline? I, I've never had to think about that, actually. <laughs> That's the tagline to the new Ghost Rider movie? Yeah, and then... Like when they're putting uh, on the poster? Yeah. The trailer <laughs> ends with him <laughs> standing with his back turned from the camera and uh, pissing fire. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> That's true. That sounds like something Nicholas Cage would just do normally. <laughs> yeah, they just caught him at a random moment. <laughs> like, this might actually might look pretty good in the movie. <laughs> <laughs> do you do you know any party tricks? Well, and piss fire sometimes. That's actually uh, it's pretty good. That would be pretty handy. It's when my uh, <laughs> venereal diseases sort of culminate. Like, when they culminate with planet? planet. <laughs> <laughs> Chlamydia! Crabs! Herpes! I summon the... Fire? Oh my god, you just created a mass... a weapon of mass destruction with that ball. <laughs> the true weapon of mass it's destruction. It's a bio weapon. Cage. By your powers combined, you're peeing fire! <laughs> And then you die. People are gonna go out of their way to get the diseases now just to get that. It's like, well, well, it's well, pretty really itchy, but... Do, all they really have to do is fill their bladder with gasoline and then put a match in front of it. <laughs> I'm playing, uh... <laughs> I don't think never... the scene would be that easy to film, though. I think... <laughs> like, Alright, steady, steady... No, stop twitching the, uh... around, man. Now we're gonna have to do this again. <laughs> I never knew about the fire accomplishment thing. I've always just been boring and played STD bingo. <laughs> Got like four in a row, but not quite five. Well, you're not gonna get the piss fire doing that. Yeah. You have to fill out every corner of the bingo board. <laughs> oh, yeah. And but my then Nicholas has diabetes. <laughs> and then Nicholas Cage that. will come down, and then you got fire piss. He comes down like a golden god. I'm giving you last two days. Speaking of crabs, look at all the crabs I got on this ball. Yeah, you just stole that family's entire supply of seafood. You what, is the nature... no, food. what is the nature of the ball that makes things attached to it? Uh, it's covered in cum, I believe. I think that's the correct <laughs> answer. Ah, yes. You went for the easy one. <laughs> Courtesy of the king <laughs> oh. of the cosmos. <laughs> yeah. I mean, his cum balls Amari are like... <laughs> Have you seen that guy's package? It's... That is kind of overwhelming. Yeah. He has to drain it like a cyst every couple of hours. <laughs> <laughs> That's why. That's why it things still stick to it even after you rolled. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It already. Like, it's oh, layers man. upon layers, man. It's like wringing out a towel that never dries. <laughs> Why the hell is that dog having a- Why is a crab riding a dog? I don't know, I'm trying to get up there, but it's just like, wrecking my shit. <laughs> I guess it's just not gonna happen. You do go grind some more then. Not yeah. enough stuff. Oh, I should probably go up here. Once these things go down, here we go. But, um, Take what me I was up. going to say, Face Guy, was that uh, while you're playing that, I am playing Summon Saga. Someone has to blow it. <laughs> it has to be done. I'll make you, you a save uh, file so you can fight the Yes! The puppy. Go for the dog! A, you know you are. Can you do a PNP stream? P stream? PNP. Oh. Fire P stream? Yes. <laughs> That's what I'm the other The other tagline in the uh, trailer isn't nearly as exciting. It's, <laughs> I'm not afraid of you. You should be. <laughs> so that sort of tells you what what kind of movie it's going to be. You didn't deliver it like Nicolas Cage. That was right? Nicolas Cage talking to the director. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get this dog. God. There we go. The dog's the heaviest object in the world. Whoa. Where are the rest Whoa. of these crabs? 
Oh, 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 oh. oh there you have him. Finally. With the power of the density of an entire solar system. Dog. Dog. Uh, when you when you have enough stuff rolled up to the ball, does it start like attracting things? No. That would no. defeat the nature of the game, because then you wouldn't have to go get stuff. Oh, well, they could still make it hard in some underwear. Oh. Well, you Basically, you're just smaller objects, but... you're just on a shopping spree in Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> if you could attract things to you, it would defeat everything. 103 is not bad. You'd be broke quite fast. I'll be sure Still. to purchase my items this way the next time I go to Walmart. Or just Except a giant like, ball and roll over Just everything. a big ball of crabs. <laughs> <laughs> you just like run into things. <laughs> I'll be intentionally anyway. aiming. <laughs> I'll be purchasing Walmart of all of its customers. Actually, yes. um... Uh... I don't remember when, but didn't like Mega 64 do something like that? With crabs? Chances are, yes. It's Mega 64. They've done everything. They they made a Katamari Damacy ball and roll it around town. Was it covered in cum? That's Thanks, probably so. how they got things to stick to it. <laughs> it's a odd job that they had someone do. Poor intern who had to do all that. <laughs> We need, Get like, 30 off. gallons of cum. <laughs> Get, Get <it>. started. <laughs> Alright, well good thing I already have about 29. <laughs> good thing I've been collecting cum vases. <laughs> After a while they just start making it in a in labor laboratory. Artificial cum. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Genetically engineered chism. <laughs> Made I've <laughs> always been confused in how he was actually able to talk and play video games. Very carefully, really. Practice. Oh, fuck. I think I'm trying to play a video game. <laughs> Don't do it. You never pull it off. Can never do it for the first time. You still play video games? God. What the fuck's wrong with you? <laughs> you disgusting human being. <laughs> According to it. the comments on your Rotsu Prey channel, you hate everybody who plays video games. Oh my god, you hate what playing is wrong them. with that cat? Where is that? <laughs> oh, I don't know, I was just guessing. Oh, well, that's true. I wish everyone was dead. This YouTube channel's the only way I can express that. <laughs> and get results. Yeah. People have killed You know themselves. how many suicides you've caused? <laughs> Do you know? Have you any idea? Do you even care? I'm... I, I condone them. <laughs> Eventually his hatred of man... Eventually his hatred of mankind is just gonna build up so much that in the next Red Super is just gonna be like, Slow Beef will say something, he'll just be like, No! No, and then he just walks away. <laughs> Leaving Slow Beef to finish the Red Supreme himself. Mm -hmm. Actually, it's been Slow Beef the whole time, just doing a diabetes impersonation. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, this is Slow Beef right now. <laughs> oh, yeah, I Looking to abandon anyone who's not streaming very well. <laughs> just going my rounds for the night, like the Let's Play security guard. <laughs> I gotta go on from Let's Play to Let's Play. Oh, uh, no, I need to get my streams per minute up. I don't See, have enough if of them. anything suspicious is going on... Any shady Whenever characters. Diabetes isn't talking, he's actually muting his mic and red supraying the stream. <laughs> <laughs> he switches he said, over to... He, said, yeah, he says something to us, and then he just mutes the microphone. Here? He starts talking, he's just like, Yeah, these guys are a bunch of idiots. As you can see, they're, they're, they're clearly using outdated stream technology. Fortunately, since my mic is mute, nothing is actually being recorded. Well, you have another one. Well, yeah, you just have two I, mics. I am. I'm wearing two headsets. <laughs> <but no. laughs> I'm wearing a headset, and then I'm, I'm in my uh, pillow fort studio. 
<laughs> he actually just he just coated his entire wall with microphones. With cum. Yeah. Uh, that's how they stick to the pillows. It's <laughs> impressive. How else would he get his microphones to stick to his head? Mm -hmm. oh, that's how he's full. He has a mohawk of microphones. In Let's Play Country. <laughs> There's... I'm not doing very well on this one, not gonna lie. Yeah, you might die or something. This is, uh, <laughs> yeah, you're... <laughs> the cat just comes over and just eats the prince. Okay. You're, not at op you're not at optimal ball levels right now. No. Not at all. Also, that street is a terrible place for picking stuff up, just FYI. This is this a N64? terrible place in general. No. no. Yes. Oh. That PS2. Oh. N64 could only have like two things on the screen at once. Yes, Before now your ball has feet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, it's one of those metals hats. Which is just a construction hat, really. So, how is he strong enough to move the ball with all that stuff? Is that ever explained in the canon? Uh, I don't know. That's actually a good question. Because he doesn't get bigger as the ball gets bigger, he just stays the same. He's like microscopic. Even, so. Well, the ball so. is his hand. That's the whole explanation. <laughs> it's actually one of his testicles. Always keep a ball on your Shit. hand. Yeah. That's how I got my Pillow Fort Studio to work. <laughs> your testicles? Wait, what? I like well, just one of them. Yeah, I beat us. I mean, I had to coax the glue out somehow. <laughs> yeah, I suppose so. Makes sense. Uh, Come on, no Bessie. <laughs> we just need a good harvest this year. <laughs> Why did all those birds just fly into me? They were drawn in. But maybe De what Declan said is happening. What, what Real is time Katamari updates. Yeah. <laughs> now they with gravity. The birds AI. Oh, no, dear God, it's, it's a Hitchcock movie. <laughs> yeah, they pick just... all the prince's eyeballs out. <laughs> He's ready to... ah! I like to see that. <laughs> Can't say I like the guy. The king's like, well, no use for you anymore. You must this become game... one with the ball. This game hasn't got, like, super Japanese yet. Oh! <laughs> the cutscenes are pretty much that. Oh, yeah. Oh, Saki. Oh. I say that every time I order Saki from them. <laughs> <laughs> they just look at you like, what? I'll have like, a Saki. They have, they have normal Giant like American accents. Drop appears next to Get them. out. <laughs> then they drop everything they have and rush in the cloud to the kitchen to get me Saki. <laughs> And then all of a sudden, some like anime chick comes out with a with a fresh dish of sake for you. Mm -hmm. Wearing no pants. I, I thought that was going <laughs> completely differently, and that the anime chick <laughs> yeah. was going to get on her knees. <laughs> kind of oh yeah, that, 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 that was coming eventually. <laughs> yeah, it was yeah just I'll say. <laughs> oh, the lead. Oh, excuse me. Whatever. Or, what the hell are those down? corn dogs? Some Corn dogs don't exist in Japan. <laughs> it's just not a thing. Don't be what my savage tea. nation. This is, <laughs> this is my new goal in life to introduce corn dogs as part of the uh, the no, Japanese diet. Like they as soon as you do it, like they all just blow destroy the ecosystem. <laughs> they have novelty hot dogs that look like tentacles. <laughs> no, you're all the girls take them. And those run are off sex to... toys. Hey. Confusing them there. Oh, already? Shit. Get in the ball, dog. So, Declan, is all Swedish television programming like what we've seen? People throwing up on live TV and... Dancing whatnot. police officers or whatever yeah. it was? Um... It's very possible. I mean, <laughs> I haven't really watched much television in the last few years, so I can really tell you. Well, it wasn't really knows. television, that's just the stuff that he records walking five blocks down his own street. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's pretty normal. normal. Find anything Swedish on YouTube, I recorded it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. 
You're a busy man. <laughs> no, you, like, you own Sweden. <laughs> you control the Swedish media. Uh, that's probably oh, not yeah. saying much, but you do. Yeah, it, it's not that hard, really. <laughs> <laughs> They're pushovers. You just tell them to do something and they do. Oh, what the fuck? So that's why everyone in Sweden plays StarCraft? No. <laughs> just like, do it. Okay. And they also all beat me. So sad. Okay, yeah, right now he's working on getting Barracks in the Probe to go on. It's one of the soapbox operas. No. Soapbox operas? What the hell is that? Yes, it's it's both a soapbox and an opera. <laughs> it's an opera using very yeah. tiny stick figures using a small soapbox as your setting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you explain one. your concept here, Cyrus. The there key is to hire foreigners to do the singing. <laughs> Oh, that makes it an opera, but what about the soapbox? Well, obviously the soapbox is there to give you a setting. Right. Oh. Is there still soap in it? This is important. It depends on the rating of the mo of the TV show. Um, like if you can R afford the soap? R and X rated, get the soap. Uh, that's oh. for the sex scenes. It's kind of dramatic. Very, oh yeah. <laughs> Graphical use of soap. <laughs> Extreme. Extreme soap sex. Well, not even that. It's just looking at soap. It's kind of an intense experience. Right, especially in Sweden. So how many Nicolas Cage movies did you watch no, today? We don't do much, <laughs> really. I think that's the important right. question here. So we uh, we have discovered the world's first perpetually rolling die. It's it's gone already. That's it. <laughs> it stopped. <laughs> They're extinct. Way to go. <laughs> oh well. Uh, by the way, Face Guy, I'm in uh, this uh, seventh saga run that I'm playing right now. Yeah. I'm playing as the robot, and I named him Anime. Just. <laughs> I don't think you can you pick can any have, other name. Well, they can only have a five-letter name, so I thought it was... Of all the names I could have picked, that seemed fitting. Well, you could have picked Alan. <laughs> I could have, but I'm not playing as him, so... It would have <laughs> no. seemed No matter what you're playing as, you're playing as him. In spirit. Is this Alan Wake's house? What the hell is with all these batteries? Wait, what? Uh... Okay. I suppose that's... <laughs> I suppose that's a little bit obscure. Basically, his flashlight runs out of battery like every two seconds. Like in most video games. Has there been a Nicolas Cage movie yet? <laughs> no. Like, not about his movies, just him. Documentary? Or? No, but a video game. <laughs> <laughs> the video game was a documentary. You should make a Nicolas Cage video game. I think he'd <laughs> like that, actually. This one is utterly insane. I mean, I'd play that. See, in the video game, you just kind of walk around his office, and then you click on office? things. <laughs> <laughs> what? So it, the, the video game required a lot of suspension and disbelief, but <laughs> if you can get over that, then uh, there was there was a lot of interesting do, uh, interviewing going on, and that was the game. Like once you interviewed him completely, it, the credits would roll up, and then a uh, pachinko commercial would pop in in the middle of it. <laughs> oh shit! I don't know where to collect anything. I'm lost. I wonder I if he knows what the pachinko is when for this game now. Send it to Valve. Maybe we'll do something with it. What are things we can have the player pick up? Hmm. These. Here we go. <laughs> I wonder what all of their throwaway ideas... Like, what were the rejected ideas for things you can pick up, is what I want to know. <laughs> if this is what is accepted, what did they reject? Like, shit no, stained diapers. You can't pick up that, that's just too insane. <laughs> 
fuck? Bullshit. Yeah, oh, but at one, room. at one point they had a few playboys laying around, but <laughs> sensors didn't like seeing that roll around every five seconds. Well, they, they liked it, but uh, they, they, they decided to get rid <laughs> they of it. They wanted them, they wanted those for themselves. Yeah, <laughs> they had to take it out. They couldn't share that with the world. They, they had to take it out for the John, the uh, John, Johnny Cash, what the hell, uh, Nicolas Cage <laughs> <laughs> picture. <laughs> I didn't know that's something you could pick up. I need to find yeah. that, like, immediately. Yeah, Nicolas Cage, Playboy. Playboy Bunny. <laughs> I, I, I... <laughs> oh my god. Once again, that sounds like a great idea. <laughs> It actually wouldn't surprise me if that's in here. Like I'll see it and I'll just be like, yeah. Yeah, there was there was actually a cheat code in the Nicolas Cage video game where you could uh, have him wear the Playboy outfit when he's uh, <laughs> giving you the interview. Wait, I thought we're supposed to be interviewing him. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Wait a second. Well, he's interviewing you for the Playboy job. <laughs> well, the game sounds pretty perfect to me. That interview wouldn't last long. Well, I'll take all your clothes off. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Is it too cold in here for you? <laughs> and the whole interview is just like listing off movies he's been in. <laughs> it's like, well. Let me tell you about what thing called Ghost Rodder. <laughs> <laughs> I thought knowing yeah. was pretty cool. Johnny Cage. Has. Wait. Johnny Cash. Nick. Ah. Johnny <laughs> Cash. <and> Nick. <laughs> Johnny Cage. Yeah, Johnny Destroyed. Cage. <laughs> <laughs> what is it with Johnny Cash and Nicolas Cage? Are they the same person? You should obviously play <laughs> Johnny Cash in some movie. It doesn't need to make sense necessarily, but you should play him. <laughs> like so anything he plays makes any sense complete. at all. <laughs> um, by the way, uh, did you see that one Mega Man race where Sir does Nicolas Cage for the duration? Uh, I did, no. he did a pretty good job. <laughs> if you haven't, you need to. It's pretty good. You got a 5 on the diabetes scale of Nicolas Cage. <laughs> that was impressive. <laughs> it must be worth watching. Oh shit, mm -hmm. The Iron Cage. <laughs> <laughs> is that his boxing name? <laughs> Nick the Iron Cage. <laughs> Do you think whenever Nicolas Cage plays poker with somebody, he invites them to a cage match? <laughs> That's why he always plays if solitaire. I, if I had a nickel for every time I heard that... Nicolas Cage is having a match with Nicolas Cage. <laughs> <laughs> it would just never end. They'd both just be, like, talking about their movies to each other. <laughs> That's, like, They'd all I could imagine him talking about. They'd be switching imagine... for obscure clues on, clues on dollar bills for how to beat each other. <laughs> <laughs> this one kind of looks like me. <laughs> <laughs> well, if I had a top hat, then I could defeat him. I found <laughs> this country, right? Nicholas Cage. Oh, I can remember. <laughs> <laughs> the Declaration of Cage. <laughs> That'd be amazing. <laughs> Get up there. Oh my god. I guess I'll just use these stairs that are right next to it. Wait, you picked up a Daruma? What the hell's a Daruma? So weed, oh my I god, think. look at that dog. <laughs> weed, you say? Weed. Oh my god, get up the goddamn stairs! Why? <laughs> get up, wow. Oh no, the dog flew off. Oh wow. Well. Oh, this is bullshit. <laughs> this is fucking bullshit. Well, if you dislocate enough of his bones, yeah, the rest of him will fly off. <laughs> Can I even get back in here? Here we go. I'm pretty sure the dog just got attached to you because he smelled all the weed inside of the ball. <laughs> Was he trained to do that? Is that oh, what police yes. dogs do when they smell weed? They just attach themselves to you? <laughs> <laughs> Good 
they become a permanent part of your body. Once you have weed. <laughs> uh, the very well trained dogs. <laughs> well, you could just kind of walk away after that. So, has anyone ever played Trine? Yes. Yes. Yep. Yes. It's pretty good. How long is it? Uh, not very. I haven't finished yet. Uh, seven, eight hours, depending on if you try to get everything. And if you're smart. Yeah, I'm playing it right now. <laughs> Just use the uh, thief or whatever and just fly through everything. I'm using the knight a lot to fuck shit up. Yeah, he's pretty good for that, but the thief can just like go everywhere. Yeah, the thief can just pretty much bypass everything. Like, there's a lot of puzzles that like you just ignore and just like use the rope to go everywhere. Oh, that game. I thought you were talking about the one where everything was a triangle. And it was really envious though. <laughs> what game is what? that? Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, the triangle game. <laughs> oh my god, it came in they, they had a low polygon budget, so they just made everything triangles. <laughs> I got it for $2 during the recent sale. <laughs> yeah, same here. I got it for like $1 through the uh, yeah. bundle. I cannot see it. You know you're addicted to Steam when you were almost when I, you were almost tempted to buy Prototype when you already own it. I got a present because there was a sale. That's just wrong. Yeah, that's not something you should actually reveal. Generally. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm cutting back now. I'm your little girl. I've already uninstalled. I can, I can half give my them speed. only. I can I I can just. Wow, she's give hiding behind the. Oh, I got her. Not okay. that much money. She's Instead of a hide behind that pole. Wow, you have like there are birds floating around your thing. That's actually Nicolas Cage. Are all of them Nicolas Cage? Like every single bird? <laughs> yeah. I think everybody who exists is Nicolas Cage in some way. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. There's a little bit of Nicolas Cage in all of us. Mhm. Mm That's important. Never forget. Watching it. it watching his movies has taught me that every single bear that I'll ever meet in real life is Nicolas Cage. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it has a very high yes, a very high probability of punching any woman it sees in the face. Oh my God, look at that thing's nose oh, back fish. there. Oh, okay. <laughs> playing with Playmobil toys now. Oh my god, a Nicolas Cage landed on his nose. <laughs> it's swatted away. <laughs> Let's see, uh... Sickness. Get out Sorry. the Nick swatter. What would it be Cage swatter? I don't know, what's better? Hmm. The Netherlands, do you know much about the Netherlands, Declan? Not really. No. They're the lands of the Nether. Are they your rivals? <laughs> <laughs> and let's they play. were at one point, but that was like 400 years ago. I think it's fine by now. Do you the are uh... truly healed? Uh, I think so. Do you I do know that they're... Of... It's densely uh... populated and uh, in danger of flooding daily. That's pretty much all I know. <laughs> By the Swedish. That's just what they yes. want you to know. <laughs> yes. We have an organization there trying to tear down their uh, dams. Infrastructure. And, uh, their levees. Yeah. <laughs> That's just what happened the to the US. <laughs> the Swedish. <laughs> Assholes. Do it. Um, oh, the Chevy is at the levee. I repeat, the Chevy is at the levee. <laughs> At one point, we did have, like, we made a, uh, me and a couple of friends made a fake, like, national party, um, just for a school thing. And then you became the, uh, leader of <laughs> And then the it Sweden. became the national holiday. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, no, not, not a party, a, like, a political party. Right. And, um... What uh, 
we had as a plan, for example, was to take over the world, and we drew up like an elaborate scheme for invading America and all this stuff. Really oh my, fun. Oh my god. I'm contacting <laughs> the police. <laughs> They're gonna see this video and be like, oh my god. We're, we're, for example, we uh, we're borrowing an idea <laughs> from Red Alert, and we're going to wire the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> from Last become, Alert? Like, oh, from Red Alert. Oh, Red yeah. Alert. That makes more sense. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> it does. Yeah. <laughs> so you're gonna put giant lasers everywhere. And then you're gonna go back in time and shake Einstein's hand and erase him from existence. <laughs> Declan, yeah. stop hiring people's feelings. <laughs> oh. oh, I I tried, but it just seems I can't. Or that's what he told me anyway. Who, Einstein? Yeah, he said, You can't hire my feelings! And then he started throwing boomerangs at me for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense. Well, if you kill him, then you get uh, Einstein boomerang. No, I just became a, uh, was it Metal Trooper or something? He became Einstein. See, I didn't even <laughs> so... know he was trained in the use of boomerangs. <laughs> Can surprise you. He also had this really useless teleport. Actually, I think I'm getting my bosses mixed up at this point. <laughs> this is possible. What would you get if you, uh, if Nicholas Cage was a robot master and you killed him? <laughs> uh, slurred speech blast? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Something along those lines. Couldn't think of anything good. Who would be weak against that? Um... One. It's like Metal Blade. <laughs> Everyone? <laughs> Speech Man? <laughs> so Eloquent Dr. Man? But then what would you get for beating Eloquent Man? <laughs> uh, you, would, you would get rid of the slurred speech beam. <laughs> You'd be free of it. So, Nicolas Cage, if you had, were president for a day, what would you do? I'd team up with, uh, Rebecca Black, make a new hit single, <laughs> Saturday. <laughs> it's my favorite time of the year. <laughs> Saturday only happens once, I think. <laughs> Sure and Nicholas Cage is like a yeah. world holiday. It's it's, it's like a it's like a leap year. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I think the show works. I declare today Saturday day. <laughs> <laughs> In the celebration of the many Saturdays that have sacrificed themselves. <laughs> so like before candy or something. So what do you do on Saturdays, then, <laughs> Nicholas Cage, to celebrate? Oh. Uh, Apparently the question broke would, like, my desk. Probably finds treasure or something. That's a hard-hitting question. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't need to. So I'm in Fangle Forest. How close am I to beating this game? Yeah, you're pretty what much done. Close? Oh, right. Uh, I have no idea. Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> it's you don't remember the shitty game? looks basically <laughs> the same. I, I don't remember every <laughs> level in the game, including their names. I'm in Fangled Forest is the forest level. <laughs> it's like a well, choose your own adventure. a lot of forest levels. <laughs> is Fangled Forest really the forest level? I don't oh, know. No. It remains to be seen. From what I remember, the first area is like old forests, and then yeah, it's like bones or something, and then something else. Every enemy in this game is bones. Yeah, but I think like the terrain is made of bones too. Oh, your yeah, balls so I... big you have balls on your balls. The terrain is made of Nicolas Cage. <laughs> The one thing I don't like about Trine is that, like, all the enemies are skeletons. Like, yeah. It's really annoying after a while. 
I was surprised how aggressive they were. Like, I actually died once because I wasn't wow. prepared Holy for Holy shit, out. you died in a video game? <laughs> <laughs> oh. You mean the, you mean you the okay? forces of the undead don't want to hug? Do you want to talk to someone about it? No, 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 no. I meant, like, they... Uh, people have been saying that the combat in Trine was really easy. So I was... I guess I was too lax, but the skeletons actually come after you pretty quickly, and... You know. I don't know about that. They it, keep climbing ledges and jumping at you, and... You could just spam arrows with the thief and just break it completely. Hmm. True. Or you could just avoid, like, every enemy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just kind of run past them. Maybe they just replace all of their bones with chicken bones to gain extra acceleration. True, true. But then they would just be like chicken skeletons. <laughs> Nonsense. <laughs> if raptors can be chickens, then so can we. Exactly. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god, he's just talking for like no reason. Nicholas Cage? <laughs> King of the Cosmos is Nicholas Cage. <laughs> god, I, I wish that, that were true. <laughs> if they if they ever did make a Katamari movie for some godforsaken reason. <laughs> oh my yeah, god, they, Nicholas they Cage should get Nicholas Cage to play. <laughs> it would be live action too, so it would be <laughs> Would it be very different from the Sorcerer's Apprentice? <laughs> no. Fairly <laughs> distinguishable. It'd basically be the same as Spy Kids 3D. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I can't Nicholas Cage is the lead kid. <laughs> if I get I'm a Spy Kid. He actually plays all of them, it's just hard to tell at first. He's just Even CG'd in. Yeah. Eventually he'll move on oh, to just having an anime of himself. <laughs> My name's Nicholas Cage, a goo. Who <laughs> <laughs> <Here we> go? <laughs> God, I'd watch the shit out of that. <laughs> Seriously. Me too. He's already been to Japan and did commercials. <laughs> Powers Next up. That is obvious. His powering up is like, uh, <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> God, I wish Nicholas Cage would turn into a Super Saiyan. <laughs> he can't, he can't hold interest for that long. <laughs> he doesn't have enough hair for that. <laughs> yeah. Just yeah. little tiny strands of yellow stand up. <laughs> He just start and then realize that he's losing what little hair he has left in his stocks. <laughs> no! It's flying away! I gotta shot the transformation. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen a Super Saiyan 3? Legend says they can grow their hair back. <laughs> That's the only reason he wants to be a Super Saiyan. <laughs> It's <laughs> my only reason to live. <laughs> Sounds about right. God, these people are making it sounds like they're fucking dying. Well, you do eventually shoot them into space, right? <laughs> so, oh, well. I guess in a way they are dying. <laughs> Not now, though. Not yet. They've got to mature first. <laughs> no, this was before. Like a fine wine. <laughs> Man, the King of the Cosmos is just a straight-up sociopath. Yeah, well, he could do whatever the hell he wants. He's probably just a dick. Oh, what's that? They're <laughs> suffocating inside of your ball of death? Oh, they're such a cute couple. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Why, wow, one of them just spoke English. That's very strange and unsettling. Yes, yes, this will accompany my other ball quite nicely. That's just like a big ball of like mutilated corpses. <laughs> Blood. Yeah, the uh, Katamara Damacy movie is going to be a horror movie. <laughs> the police are going to be tracking him down and they just find balls of corpses. At, well, but sorry, Nicholas Cage, and of course it's going to be a horror movie. <laughs> All they you, find you are balls. That, you know that one boss in Castlevania, Grand Buffoon? I think that's what it's going to look like, basically. Or maybe you don't. I, I have no idea. Wait to All I heard. Conversation, yeah, I just went to <laughs> Castlevania and then blinked out. Uh, there is a boss in Symphony of the Night called Grandalfoon, or something along those lines, which is a huge corpse ball that flies. Sweet. Is Hell you... yeah. Haven't played that. <laughs> Have you played that game? <laughs> no. I've never played Symphony of the Night. Well, oh, we so. know what this no, stream is to become it. now. You're going to be it's a very start streaming Symphony game. of the Night. <laughs> so that we understand... Uh, I'll Dectalon. probably never Dectalon. beat it. Yeah, so we can understand Dectalon's jokes a little bit. <laughs> Swedish humor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need to I need to write that in my in my uh, textbook of, uh, of Swedishisms. They like Castlevania. Okay. <laughs> Like Got Nicholas that Cage. out of the way. Nicholas Cage. <laughs> <laughs> Nicholas Cage has Swedish citizenship now. <laughs> no. It wouldn't surprise me if he does somehow. The Grand King of uh, Sweden gave it oh to him. Oh my god, Nicholas Cage. Grand King. We have several, Lizzie. Oh, there's Talk Show Island already. One of them is Nicholas Cage's brother. <laughs> I wish we didn't have one. Hmm, the one we do have is like kind of annoying. Guy. Top Shell Island? What, why is it even called that? There's there's no defining feature for that to be a logical name. Man, where's the logic in my Katamari Damacy game? I think we can do one more level. We'll take a quick I'm break. the only one that sees the logic here? Man, I must be insane. Monster in a box. It's really quite a linear game when you look at it. <laughs> mm, yes. Oh man. Oh, see? Mm. He's, he's speaking Arabic. He's... He's, he's different from us. Kill him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the thief does make this a lot easier when you spam arrows. Yeah. You see, this you eventually, uh, can get exploding arrows. I have fire arrows right now. Or maybe the fire arrows, I don't know. prototype for how they were going to take care of 9-11, but then somebody else did it before they could, so... We'll just put random shit everywhere. What? <laughs> <laughs> have just have cats different... walking around. <laughs> we're going to force them to pick things up. <laughs> All these, like, OCD fucking, like, 400 pound people. Hit them. I can't pick it up! I can't lift up my fat flames to pick up that cat! It's a good Nicholas Cage impression. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was uh, impersonating diabetes. <laughs> That's pretty close as well. <laughs> they blend together. Nicholas Beatus. <laughs> Nicholas Beef. <laughs> Shit. Dun dun dun. Was that inappropriate? No, that was spot on. <clears throat> I just have no idea where to go. Put really, in the Nicholas Katamari. Uh, oh. What? Uh, <laughs> go ahead. I was just gonna suggest you put in the Katamari Justin Bailey code. What would that um, even do? Just yeah. try it and see. Uh oh. Sounds frightening. Frighteningly sexy. <laughs> yeah, you hear uh, Nicolas Cage actually bought the rights to Nickelodeon. It's uh, Nicolas <laughs> Odeon now. <laughs> all Nick, Cage, all the time. Cage <laughs> <laughs> Nick, 
page of loading. <laughs> oh my it's just God, like a bunch so... of cartoons that are like about him. <laughs> he does the hey. voiceover work for every character. <laughs> Let's see. Hey, he Nicholas. animates them. Every character's name hey. Nicholas Cage. <laughs> He doesn't even try to hide the fact that it's him. <laughs> it's that's exactly the same. <laughs> he also Nicholas refers, Hopper. like, regardless of character, he still refers to every character as Nicolas Cage. <laughs> so it's kind of confusing. Even if Especially it's like a dog or something. Before. The entire credits just says Nicolas Cage <laughs> as Nicolas Cage. <laughs> yeah, several Nicholas times. Vader of Cage. And then, of course, there's like the uh, sitcom that's starring Nicolas Cage. <laughs> the sweet life of Nick and Nick. <laughs> <laughs> Nick, Nick at Nick. All Cage. Dora the uh, Nicolas Cage. Ah, uh, real Nicolas Cage. <laughs> Dora the Nicolas Cage. <laughs> Nicolas Cage, Nicolas Cage pants. <laughs> Are you smarter than Nicolas Cage? It's like... It's <laughs> like a... wins that game. <laughs> it's like an episode of the Teletubbies, but like, the sun has a picture of Nicolas Cage's face on it. Yeah, I wish I was Nicolas Cage right now. <laughs> <laughs> he makes an outrageous amount of money just because. To make this all topical, he really loves Katamari Damacy. Isn't he incredibly <laughs> bankrupt right now? <laughs> Damn. Not not just slightly bankrupt. Incredibly <laughs> bankrupt. <laughs> Incredible <laughs> bankruptcy. He's super. Well, he's poor. he's the entire country of Greece right now. So yeah, <laughs> he's pretty bad off. President it was a Cage. bad investment, really, buying Greece. <laughs> <laughs> I just bought it because I really like that movie. <laughs> He was dis disappointed to find that the fashion trend was no longer leather coats. But he decided to keep wearing it anyways. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. That is a big ball. Is it impressive? It's a very impressive ball. Good the cows shit. are probably lactating all over it. Does it intimidate you? His big ball. <laughs> well, yeah, it's pretty obvious the king is gonna have lopsided balls now because this one's just way too huge compared to the last one. Oh, is this this is the one I got stuck on? I think. Well, my friend got stuck on, not me. Yeah, your friend. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get stuck right. on no stinking level. I ain't no faggot. <laughs> <laughs> Only Fergus gets stuck in this fucking level. <laughs> Real Fergus! Can you imagine, like, oh, a man. bunch of guys, like, never played a video game before from the south, and this is, like, the first thing they play? Yeah, that'd be awful. <laughs> <laughs> the also... Fergus fucking rolling around and shit! <laughs> is this enhancing the homosexual agenda? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, by the way, Diabetes, in my brief time spent in the South, I can tell you one good thing that you have. Higgly, okay. Wiggly, Higgly Wiggly is the best supermarket I've ever been to. It's pretty Here. good. Yeah. Hey, good job. <laughs> good, you good, got, job uh, <laughs> good job, Diabetes. Good job on your you Piggly Wiggly it. business. <laughs> I don't know how you did it, but you did it. <laughs> Took a lot of effort. But was it worth it? The yeah. creative mind behind Piggly Wiggly. <laughs> <laughs> what are two Cage. words that rhyme that also aren't really words? <laughs> uh oh, it's our business around it. <laughs> so Pig riding business? No. 
Okay, let me think. <laughs> I got this. What is something that people may want? I don't know, food? <laughs> Ow. Shit. Oh, That's the stupidest Brilliant. thing and I ever heard. <laughs> That's the best southern impression I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> well, I have to go into English and then into southern accent. It's hard. <laughs> A <laughs> double filter. Does Sweden have a south? Um... Like, colloquially yes. speaking? <laughs> yes. And, uh, interestingly see? enough, that's where our racists are. <laughs> <laughs> it works out. It's universal. Damn. <laughs> south everywhere. What about Southern California? Uh, I don't know, yes. what, what's defining about that? Well, it's Southern. They... Right. they those are where the races are as well. In oh. San Diego? <laughs> no. Yeah, we have a town called San Diego. No. <laughs> uh. I like to imagine that if Dectalon ever moves to the United States, he'll end up developing a perfect southern accent. <laughs> God, I hope Dude, so. The first thing, oh, like, shit, I would fuck? practice one for a year before <laughs> I actually went there. And it would be instantaneous, actually. You'd be like, howdy, y'all. I just immigrated from Sweden. <laughs> <You're> like, <laughs> they're like, oh my god, what happened? What is happening to our country? No, they'd be like, well, <laughs> Swedish what? Swedish fried chicken. <laughs> Swedish fried chicken. Not bad. <laughs> Covered in chocolate. <laughs> mm -hmm. That doesn't sound too great. Or yeah, well, you good. haven't been in America long enough. Yeah, yeah, it's, a bit, yeah. it's a bit tough. You need to use the Swiss Army knife to cut it open. <laughs> it, it'd go Chocolate right along with our uh, deep fried butter. Oh, God. oh yeah, I saw that. <laughs> that what? That was. The... <laughs> he Maybe saw that, and then he's How in shock. How does that even work? Well, well you, you take a butter and you just melts. You put some batter on oh. it, and they throw it in there. You, you can deep fry ice cream, so... Yeah, you'd be surprised what you're capable of deep frying. <laughs> when you're desperate <laughs> enough. <laughs> you can do anything. And you're being paid by Paula Dean. <laughs> yeah. That too. Didn't she get into a fight recently? Yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> like a fist fight? <laughs> a fight. <laughs> yeah, I remember... What do you mean I can't deep fry this? <laughs> I, I remember the episode where Bear Grylls had to deep fry a lizard to survive. <laughs> he had a deep fryer with him? <laughs> to survive, his camera crew refused to feed him. <laughs> oh man. There's no fire food from. Fire food? Firewood for miles. <laughs> fire food? That sounds edible. <laughs> I guess Maybe I'll we just deep fry out it my first. pocket deep fryer. <laughs> <laughs> then skin this cameraman to get his fat for fire. He found a naturally occurring fryer in the African wilderness. Uh, so that's how they made fried chicken. <laughs> God, so beautiful. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's a dandelion. Yay. <laughs> oh, I see it. So is that what California flocked to when you when space travel became available? Okay. Became available? <laughs> For mass consumption? <laughs> hell yeah. California's what, a hell of a place. You don't have 50 million to spend or whatever? Well, I do. Thanks to Red Super. Yeah. I mean, you were mentioning PC Gamer, that like set you up for life. Fuck yeah. Alright, well, I'm gonna end the stream. PC Gamer really paid us $10 today. million dollars to put us in a bonus tip in there. Damn. He's ending the stream, what? No! Yeah. You can't do this! We were Maybe having so much Nicolas Cage fun. <laughs> this guy just wanted to play Desert Strike. <laughs> Is that oh, what you're yeah. doing next?